Sanjay Kalpana here. So in this video, we are going to solve these two differential equations using variable separable method. So let's get started. Problem. First one. We have to solve the given differential equation. dy by dx plus square root of 1 minus y square by 1 minus x square equals to 0. Solution. The given differential equation is dy by dx plus square root of 1 minus y square by 1 minus x square equals to 0. So you could write it as dy by dx plus square root of 1 minus y square by square root of 1 minus x square equals to 0. So you could write it as dy by square root of 1 minus y square plus dx by square root of 1 minus x square equals to 0. So here the variables are separable, right? Now integrating on both sides, integrating Could also write it as 1 by square root of 1 minus y square into dy plus integral 1 by square root of 1 minus x square into dx equals to 0. Since we know that integral 1 by square root of 1 minus x square into dx equals to sine inverse x plus c So this becomes sine inverse y plus sine inverse x equals to c integral constant which is the required solution. Fine. Now coming to the second problem. Problem solve dy by dx equals to e power y minus x. Solution given differential equation is dy by dx equals to e power y minus x, right? So you could write it as dy by dx equals to e power y into e power minus x, okay? Since e power a plus b can be written as e power a into e power b or e power a minus b can be written as e power a into e power minus b. Okay? Fine. So now you can take this to the denominator of LHS and take this dx to right hand side. You will get dy by e power y equals to e power minus x into dx. Okay? Since we know that reciprocal of e power x is equals to e power minus x. So here you are having 1 by e power y, right? 
So you could write it as e power minus y into dy equals to RHS as it is. So here the variables are separable. Now integrating on both sides. Integral a power minus y into dy equals to integral a power minus x into dx. Since we know that integral a power minus x dx equals to a power minus x by minus 1 plus c. So you could write it as minus a power minus x plus c. Right? So here you are having e power minus y into dy. Integral e power minus y into dy can be written as minus e power minus y equals to minus e power minus x plus integral constant c. Okay? Therefore, minus z e power minus y equals to minus z e power minus x plus c is a required solution. So this completes the second problem. Fine. So we have seen two problems from differential equation in this video. Hope you'll understand. We'll see you in the next video. Until then, bye bye.